Okay, folks, we are back with another episode of the Superbus Project, and today I am with Peacemaker. Say hello. Hello. And we are going to be taking this ply board and turning it into walls for this. And uh, yeah, so we're going to get on with that. I've just I've just built the final bit to go up there, uh, similar to this bit, except it hasn't got a nice curve on it. And uh, that's out in the sun ceiling as we speak. That's down there, drying out. And uh, so we're now going to get on with this and we'll catch you back up once we've made some progress. Victory! This shit is messy, horrible, uh, some of the benefits it's got going for it is it's easy to cut and it insulates. So this is what we're using to insulate the walls. Um, so yeah, this is what we're going to get on with. Uh, we've done that first little bit, it looks pretty good. And now we're just going to cut out the rest and then we're going to put the walls up. And that's it for that one section. And then we've got to do the back section as well. And then we've got to do the side section. And then that's it. And then cover it in lino, job done. Ha ha! Isn't it exciting? Insulation. And this will also act as a sort of extra support. So whenever someone leans up against the wall, it's got let, like there's no, not going to be any caving or anything like that. So this is sweet. Thank you, Nick. Uh, so we're now going to get on. We're, we don't think we've got enough of the thick insulation to do this back wall, but we're going to try with the thinner insulation. The reason this doesn't matter so much is we're not going to be leaning on the outside in as much so the thinner insulation we've got up there or uh, styrofoam I think it's that one uh, that will be what we use here so yeah that's what we're getting on with next and then we've also got to do the ply board and then yeah clean up. and then clean up yeah <laughs> there's one of them doodads there's the other you can see they've been nailed in Nick's out there with a the jigsaw cutting up that piece for the back there. Then he's got to do one more. And then we've got to do these two side bits and then we should be sweet. So we're going to get on with that and we'll catch you back up as soon as we know what's going on. Nick has expertly cut both sides of this one, the tricky one. Uh, the insulation for this bit is over on the sofa at the moment. So that's all cut and ready to go. And all we've got to do is uh, nail it in. So yeah. Okay, so Nick's just cutting the last piece to go on the outside here. I've finished hammering in this bit here. Unfortunately I couldn't get into the far end and get all the nails in because this thing's stopping me from swinging back. If I can ever get one of those things that you just press it against the thing and it fires a nail into the wall, that'd be sweet. I'll finish it with that. Um, that's got all insulation in it as well. Uh, this is the last bit to go on the, f the inside. So that's going 
there and yeah there is insulation for that I think it's down there and uh, yeah so we're getting on and uh, it's very awesome so we'll show you once uh, we've got the last couple of bits in check it out it is completed or at least the walls are completed we've planed this one we've got to plane this one still but massive thanks to Sir Peacemaker for his assistance. That has been absolutely amazing. And uh, yeah, uh, I don't know what's next. I'm probably going to get on with playing in this. And then we will see. But I just wanted to let you know it is done, it is boxed in. Check this out. How cool is that? Lights up the bathroom quite a lot as well, so that's really cool. Uh, so yeah, we're going to crack on, see you soon. Alright guys, that's going to be it from us today. Massive thanks to Peachmaker for helping us out. No Unf worries. Unfortunately the light has beaten us today, so uh, we're going to have to call it a day. But um, before we finish, just to let you know, we have applied anti-rust paint to not only the metal that we cut yesterday but also the leaf spring and some of the stuff underneath there that's going to get like obviously we're going to try and direct the pipe away as much as possible but just for added reassurance we've coated some of the stuff under there with uh, anti rust paint as well so uh, that should make my underside of that well at least that side a little more safe and last a bit longer but uh, all the walls are in all I've got to do now is build a door and then I've got to mastic all the seal, I've got to seal it all in with mastic and that. And then I've got to do the lino, and I, I think that's about it. Lino and then install all the wall works and what have you. We're sweet. That's going to be it from us today, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Take it easy, all the best, and I will catch you on the next episode. Bye bye.